Oh, she was real, a real nice little girl. He would have the other girls beat her up. That's what pimps do. This was a crime of extreme rage. Whoever killed this person had to have been drenched in her blood. They said he's the guy. He did it. They had nothing to link LeBru to the crime. Zero. I really never thought that LeBru Jones did it. For 20 years, Lois Hall has had doubts that the man serving a life sentence here at Otisville State Prison is really the man who killed her daughter. Since 1989, because of a strange set of circumstances, the conviction of LeBru Jones in the murder of Mickey Hall has also troubled me. Last year, I met with the Manhattan District Attorney's Office and told them what I knew. Within days, the case was reopened. Read the full story in the January 13th Sunday Record, and then return to Record Online and see interviews with both families. I'm thinking now, in retrospect, I could have done something. He left all of his faith in their hands, and they deceived him. Footage of LeBru's dad, a jazz legend. The London Times said that he was the fastest drummer in the world. And an interactive crime scene map with photos and expert analysis. One would think about a serial homicide offender maybe, maybe there and that he spent time with the body. And then decide if you believe what LeBru Jones has been saying for all these years.